Mike deserves a one big thank you for the work he has done for the hospice. For the last 25 years, Mike Pullin has encouraged his community to raise money for their local hospice in Michaels. Mike is very humble. Yeah, he's, he's loved by everybody. When Mike retired from his job as a printer, he wanted to use his free time to help others, so he started his fundraising efforts. Since then, he's masterminded some unusual ways to raise money. He rode with a friend of his a horse and carriage from Ledbury in Herefordshire all the way over to London. And that was really the start of his, uh, his fundraising campaign. In the years that have followed, Mike's kept the money rolling in any way he can. From skydiving to starting a motorcycle club, St Michael's Hereford Hospice Angels. There's about 50 of them in the group. The group have been all over Europe raising money. It is magical, mind. It's great seeing all the bikes together. He is the one person that drives us on. They've done rides where they've gone and they've raised £10,000 in a day. Over the last two decades, Mike's managed to raise a staggering sum of money, more than £600,000. So without those donations, we just wouldn't be here. We wouldn't be able to provide the free care to those that have terminal illness. He needs all the recognition he can get. Oh, we love him already. £600,000 is amazing. It is an outrageous amount of money. And we wanted our one big thank you to really take Mike by surprise. So we needed someone who could keep a straight face, play along. Uh, you know, otherwise it could be all a little bit um, pointless. <laughs> For this week's One Big Thank You, we're at Elstree Studios on the set of Mike's favourite game show, Pointless. And we've roped in its star presenter, Alexander Armstrong, to surprise him. Now, we're mid-filming here at Pointless, but the team and I were never going to pass up an opportunity to surprise someone as special as Mike. Now, he thinks he's here with his friends for a little, little backstage tour. That's what the ruse is. But little does he know that instead of watching the show, he's actually going to get much closer to the action than he could ever have dreamt. As the tour continues, Mike and the motorcycling buddies from his fundraising group are greeted by the Pointless studio team. Hello. Hello, you're all right. His friends are all in on the surprise, and Mike thinks he's being filmed for social media. They're being led into what Mike believes is a behind-the-scenes look at a full rehearsal. Well, this is good. This is not yeah, really yeah. happening. <laughs> On Pointless, contestants stand at podiums to answer questions. For this rehearsal, three stooges are standing in, but the teams deliberately left podium one empty. I wonder who they might rope in to fill that spot. Kew Alexander and his guest host, Stephen Mangan. Thanks, everyone, for doing what this. Do we need... Have we got a podium one? Have we got anyone? Guys, have we got anyone to stand in? With some gentle persuasion, Mike joins Alexander on stage. So, Sandra, look, this is Mike. He's on a tour. Oh, you're going to come and stand in? Yeah, nice to meet you. Nice so, to meet you. With Mike in position, it's time to start the rehearsal. OK, we're playing the titles. Little does Mike realise this isn't a classic game of Pointless as he knows it. We've planted questions where he's at the centre of the answers. So he's in for a surprise or two. Thank you very much indeed. Hello, I'm Alexander Armstrong, and a very warm welcome to Pointless the Quiz, where the lowest scorers are the biggest winners. As the game gets underway, Alexander's going in for his first question. Historic counties that end in Shire. Well, I come from a Shire. I'm from uh, Herefordshire. The aim is to find the most obscure correct answer that the fewest people would have given. OK, we'll see how many of our 100 people said Herefordshire. Herefordshire, correct answer. Oh, look at that's a pointless answer. And being a pointless answer, it adds £250 to today's jackpot, taking the total up to £1,250. It scores you nothing and is altogether terrific. Yes, Frank Oz, the puppeteer with the Muppets, was born in Herefordshire. No. Yeah. Mike is none the wiser. So it's time for Alexander to up the ante with a picture question. Famous motorbike riders. A. The first four pictures are B. all famous bikers. But the C. final photo would be very familiar D. to Mike. And E. Mike recognises himself immediately, and the game's up. 
There we are. Yes, we knew all about you, Mike, for goodness sake. You <laughs> didn't come here for a tour. You came here because you are an amazing person. I am here on behalf of The One Show uh, to say a one big thank you to you. We've heard about the astonishing sum of money that you have raised uh, for the hospice, which currently stands at £650,000. Huge round of applause for Mike. <laughs> It's not all about me, Xander. Well. There's a couple over there. It's all about the people that have been part of the Hospice Angels and all the incredible people that I meet. Well, Mike, do you know what? That's amazing of you, and it takes a very special person to unlock that generosity of spirit in people, and that is what you have done. And that is not all, Mike. I've got some messages for you as well. Hi, Mike. It's Roman from The One Show. Your dedication over so many years certainly has made a difference. The love you show is truly worthy of a one big thank you, and we're not the only ones in awe of your generosity. I will never forget the epic journey you did with my dad from Ledbury to London by horse-drawn vehicle. You're just truly wonderful. And the work Mike Pullen does for the hospice is awe-inspiring. This is wonderful that he's getting some recognition and well done, Mike. What a lovely surprise for all your hard work that you've done for the hospice over the years and the many you've raised. You're a true inspiration to so many and truly deserve this acknowledgement. And actor and presenter Stephen Fry recorded this message for Mike. Michael, 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 what can I say? For over 20 years, you have skydived, gone on motorcycling tours with the hospice angels. You've put your life and soul into the cause that you hold so dear, the St. Michael's Hospice. We admire you so much. Well... There is one more thing. Stephen, will you come over here and do the honours? Of course. A pointless trophy for you. Finally, Mike's feelings get the better of him. <sighs> I get very emotional on times like this, but, but thank you very much. Yeah.